We still have some time left yep. to take a look at today's trending stories. And I'm just going to say they are fantastic today. I'm oh, really excited to talk stories. about all the stories yes. today. Let's get into today's Hot, Hot topics. topics. All right, now Oprah Winfrey, mm -hmm. George Lucas, and Steven Spielberg, and now... Tyler Perry. Welcome to the club, Tyler. That's right, Tyler. <laughs> also, Jason Sewell and Jacqueline House uh, uh, as yeah. well are part of a very elite group. Forbes magazine reports that the filmmaker is officially worth one billion dollars. <laughs> <laughs> the newly minted billionaire owns the rights to all 22 wow. of his movies, which has grossed nearly a billion dollars to date. Perry also owns more than 1,200 episodes. Wow. Right? Two dozen plays and a 330 acre studio lot in Atlanta. Tyler Perry killing the game right he now. He is multi talented. You know, everything I've ever seen him in and everything. I mean, he directs, he acts in, he's a comedian, he's on stage. You yeah. can find him everywhere. He produces. So, um, yeah, obviously he's worth a lot too. I'm excited for him. He, you know, he's got that um, pretty much a compound in Atlanta yeah, he where does. he's been housing right. the cast of his show so that they can safely tape um, the show so they yeah. can kind of keep the content um, rolling out. So if you follow him on social media, and I do encourage you to follow him on social media, he's always kind of posting what they're up to. And then, of course, the play that pretty much launched his career, Medea, right. that yeah. play is doing uh, a final farewell that's uh, right. tour that's now streaming, I saw. That's right, yeah. absolutely. Uh, well, if you are a DC Comics fan, I know I am, uh, <laughs> and you use the Waze app for GPS navigation, then you'll want to know about this. Okay. So in celebration of Batman Day, which is coming up on September 19th, for everybody who didn't know September 19th is Batman Day, you can now choose the voice of Batman or the Riddler okay. to give you directions on your next adventure. The voices should be familiar ones. Waze and DC brought back Kevin Conroy to voice Batman and Wally Winger to voice the Riddler. Waze has also added the choices of the Batmobile or Riddler's racer in place of your usual car icon. That's fun. <laughs> and you can even listen to special DC superhero or supervillain playlists through the Waze audio player and Spotify. It is all just for a limited time, though the fun ends on October 31st. Okay. Halloween. Halloween. Is that, that's kind of things. fitting, I guess. Okay. All right. I got it. <laughs> the fun is over on right. Halloween. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> all right. Now, this story breaking today. Today, right now. Yes. Just broke. <laughs> just broke. We're breaking it. We are. <laughs> Not really. All right. The stars aligning for season 29 of Dancing with the Stars. Now, this morning, the newest cast announced, here's one of them, yeah. Backstreet Boys, AJ McLean, which he actually has a pretty good advantage because, of course, being in Backstreet Boys, yeah. he's got some dance moves already. He's posted a couple of videos on his social media already of him dancing. And again, I mean, he's a former uh, boy band yes. member, so he's got the moves. Also, here's an interesting add to the season this Come year. On, Are y'all ready for this? Tiger King star Carol Baskin. Carol Baskin. Also uh, joining the Dancing yes. with the Stars cast. I can only imagine what her partner is going to dream up for them to dance to and the costumes. Uh, former Bachelorette Caitlin uh, Bristow is going to be uh, one of the celeb dancers. Former NFL player Vernon Davis. Oh. Monica, who is the head coach from the show Cheers right, very on popular. Netflix. Uh, Cheer, rather. She's going to be on the show. Uh, my friend, my BFF, <laughs> in my mind at least, real host Jeannie Mine. She's also going oh. Wow. to be dancing as well. And here's another one I'm super excited about. Who? Nelly. Oh, bringing the country grammar yes. to the show. Yes, he is going to be on there as well. This season also as well, Tyra right. Banks taking over as executive producer and host. Man, yes, so the new season lineup. kicks off on September 14th. Well, let's keep talking about some celebrities. Let's <laughs> talk about Channing Tatum. He is proving he's the ultimate girl dad. The actor announced that he's written a children's book. Cute. That's right. It's called The One and Only Sparkella, about a little girl who gets teased for wearing sparkly things to school, but her dad helps and encourages her. Tatum posted a photo of himself with the book on Instagram. He said he, quote, found his inner child during quarantine, <laughs> end quote, and ended up creating the book for his seven-year-old daughter, Everly. The book is set for release next May. Very cute. Super cute. Also, this picture, I have all the questions, oh, yes. but we don't have time for them <laughs> right now. now. Have you ever wondered how a town came up uh, or the story behind like a landmark oh, yeah. as you're traveling yes. or what the plaque on the side of a highway is all about? Well, if the answer is yes, then guess what? There's an app for that. The Here Here app oh, provides here two to three see. minute stories giving listeners tidbits uh, they are unlikely to get from a history book or a visitor's guide. The app 
the app has major star power. Oscar award winner Kevin Costner, Ooh. he serves as a writer, editor, and one of the narrators for the app. Yeah, let's hope it goes the way more of like dancing uh, with wolves instead of uh, sure. Waterworld. Sure. Okay, okay. <laughs> Shots fired. Okay, I got yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's talk about Ariana Grande. Uh, she has no tears left to cry, and she doesn't need them. Grande is the first female to get 20 million Instagram followers. 200 million. Oh, sorry. I read that wrong. <laughs> See, welcome to the club, 200 million. That's I right, that's right. Everybody Just like Tyler Perry, yeah. Ariana Grande, they're joining my club. Now, she beat out... Um, Kylie Jenner and Selena Gomez. Uh -huh. She has found out ab about Instagram accomplishment on Saturday, and then Sunday night she took home the award for best collaboration along with Lady Gaga for their hit single, Rain On Me. Yeah. Wow, this has been a big couple days for Ariana Grande. Yeah, 200 million That's followers. That's crazy. That's crazy. I mean, it didn't take us long to get there at all, Ariana, no, if you want some days. tips on how to manage uh, your celebrity. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> we'll be right no, back with we're work good day. <laughs> anyway, we're here we're for here you, Ariana. Yeah, got you.